this is why you should uh, disable the Java automatic uh, update. So what I'm going to do is show you how to disable it. And uh, if you ever need to update it, you can do it manually uh, just by going to Java's website and download it. But that is uh, that is uh, the threat that comes up. All right, I just found it on it, and it's marked as severe. All right, and uh, I'm using uh, Microsoft Security Essentials. Right, I have a couple of uh, Java pictures to show you. Okay, uh, some computer uh, computer that I cleaned up. Uh, so it be added to that other one, the first one, the video that you saw. Uh, here's the Java. The Trojan. Uh, it's not Java Corporation is not the one that made the virus. Somebody else. It's a Trojan downloader. Here's another one right here. Okay, and then if I go to this, if I go to the other one, the next one over, uh, this is number Java 3, that's that picture right there. Here's another uh, Java, and there's another Java. So he had a total of seven uh, viruses. Uh, all the Java ones are severe. So the hot bar is not, the open candy is not, all right, which are just adwares. But uh, these guys, these guys are severe. So, and that's what uh, destroyed the guy's hard drive, including his restore petition. All right, so it's very important to disable Java. Uh, and uh, I'm going to show you how to do that in Windows 7 and in Windows 8. To install Java update, or actually deactivate the update, hit start, ms, config. All one word. And that's the file right there. If you enter or click on it, this comes up. Right, go to startup. And uh, you can't make this any bigger, but you can move these over and, and see things. So uh, scroll it down. There's Java right there. All right now, heads up, you may have other things with Java hidden in, uh, in the manufacturer, in the command line. And it's the other things that actually cause the virus problem. Java is not. Okay, so Java is a good corporation. Oracle Corporation is good. But to, un to, to actually disable the update, you're going to take the check out of the box, hit apply, and OK, and it's going to want to restart. Okay, so I'm going to exit without restarting because I'm doing this recording. So I'm going to exit re without restarting. Once you restart, the Java won't uh, update anymore, and then go to java.com to get the updates manually. All right, in Windows 8, the way you uh, prevent uh, Java from startup, and I might have already done it on this one, so uh, you could, there, you'd go to uh, search, and you hit MS, type in msconfig. Okay, and it's right there. And now uh, this all looks the same as Windows 7, but when you go to startup, this is what comes up. Use Task Manager. We're going to click on that, and this is all the startup features in Task Manager. All right now, if you look down this, all right, and uh, and you'll find certain things, and you have Enable and the Start function. So uh, we're going to come down here to Java, and over here, you highlight that, and there's Enable. If I took something and uh, highlighted it, disable would be down here, and you click on disable. So if yours says enable right here, click disable, and it will be disabled. The nice advantage about this, you do not have to restart your computer when it's done. So uh, so it's pretty sweet. All right, so that's uh, that's both in Windows 7 now and now in Windows 8. So hopefully you find it uh, helpful. Hey, you know, a lot, a lot of people that I talk to say that if you... Uh, if you, uh, no, that's one of my YouTube videos. Let's, let's go Google uh, Google Java. All right. If you have to update Java, you go to the download right here. Okay, and it'll come up and say what version you have, and then uh, you can download the newest version. Most of the time, when you go to a website that says your version is outdated, you can click on it and go straight here and download the newer. And it's a manual way of downloading. Hopefully you found the video uh, helpful. Uh, it will help keep the, uh, download, the Java download uh, severe virus type thing off of your, uh, the Trojan off of your computer. All right. Definitely keep your antivirus updated and scan your computer on a regular basis.
the pass this on to a friend, subscribe, and see you much more. Bye now.